wireless networks can be as simple as your average home setup or as complicated as the ones found in the enterprise environments. But despite the size of the network, the underlying technology does not differ much. In wireless networking, the hardware will likely determine how well the network will function. The wireless NIC and the wireless access point are the two fundamental technologies used in wireless networks. These techs connect with each other to transmit data. For a device to communicate on a wireless network, it needs to have a wireless NIC. This NIC will achieve a wireless connection by first scanning the surrounding area for available access points. Because wireless connections are separate from that of LAN connections, wireless NICs are required to have their own MAC and IP addresses. For a network to be able to provide wireless services, it needs to have at least one wireless access point. This will be the central connecting point for wireless devices. A wireless access point will alert devices of its availability by broadcasting its service set identifier. There are two modes or topology that can be used when creating a wireless network. The usefulness for each mode will be determined by the number of devices needed and the longevity of the network. Currently, the most common mode in wireless networking is called infrastructure. This design is similar to that of the star topology. At the center is a wireless access point. This mode can be used in small and large networks and is ideal for long-term use. A not so common mode in wireless networking is called ad hoc. In this design, there is no central point or wireless access point. All devices are connected directly to each other by their wireless NICs. This is similar to the mesh topology. Currently, ad hoc mode is mostly found in small and temporary networks. But with the arrival of IoT, this networking design will likely become more common. So in conclusion, the two most common technologies found in wireless networks are the wireless NIC and the wireless access point. These two technologies connect with each other to create wireless connections. The infrastructure mode is implemented more often than that of ad hoc, but the Internet of Things might shift that balance. That's all for now on wireless networking infrastructures. Head over to heymit.com for more information.